In order to help better protect Arizona forests from megafires, SRP is using artificial intelligence to provide early warning detection, ultimately protecting the watershed and providing reliable power to the valley. Currently we're up here, we're just north of the 260 near Forest Lakes on the Apache Sit Graves uh, National Forest. We're in the heart of the watershed right here on the salt system. So it's got a big footprint when you talk about fire. Behind us is the 500 corridor. So one of the major uh, paths for SRP bringing the generation into the valley. It's got a couple power plants on it from you know remote areas that transmission brings all the generation down to the valley. So it's extremely critical for SRP and our partners. So we're installing the Smoke D uh, cameras on this tower behind me, which is going to be a set of four detectors slash cameras that uh, work off of AI, artificial intelligence, that looks for smoke and uh, provides alerts. In this region, it's going to help give early notification to the fire agencies. We can put these out in the middle of the forest as long as we had some kind of phone uh, reception. This is a pilot program. It's the first of its kind here in the States where you're actually putting the cameras slash detectors on utility structures. This is one of six different towers. These are all solar and they're using public cellular for the communications and a router. And they're starting to hang the electronic cabinets. And then below that and in the middle, they'll hang the solar panels. And then they'll start working on the outside legs. You can see one mount already and uh, you'll see one of those on all four legs. That'll pretty much make the site. So 360 degree view then from this tower location up to a 10 mile range, each one about 100 degree field of view. So you can turn the cameras from the alert view to look at what's out there right now. They're already starting to put one of the detectors up looking south. So they're testing electronics, making sure everything comes up online. So that's the place where the system sees smoke. Okay, yep. Picking this site was strategic. We came out, we measured the, the signal strength from a cellular phone to make sure we had communications and the location of where it was at to, you know, surrounding communities. And then obviously being on our 500 kV system, you know, to protect this corridor. SRP did submit part of a DOE grant just recently for another seven sites. The more we spread these out, it has the benefit of getting early notification to the responders. And with that, they're out sooner. Quicker response, smaller fires is always better for the watershed. Today is just a start of a, hopefully a long-term partnership with the Forest Service, with the DFFM and other agencies as we work on better ideas for notifications, emergency response within the watershed, on our electric system, just in general. The ones we did a month ago has already received alerts on a known fire, and we've processed that and shared that with the Forest Service, so they're very excited about that as well.